All right. Um, at this center, you're going to be doing an art piece inspired by the work of Piet Mondrian. Mondrian used primary colors, and he organized his paper by using vertical and horizontal lines. By creating all of these little boxes, he would fill in boxes using the primary colors plus black, and then leaving some of them white. He always tried to make his work look balanced by separating these boxes into more boxes. And he never put two colors the same next to each other. So if you notice, there's never going to be a red next to a red, or a yellow next to a yellow, or a blue next to a blue. All right, so we are going to start off with step one. Draw straight lines, vertical and horizontal. No diagonal lines. So on a piece of paper, you are going to need a ruler and a black Sharpie. On your paper, using the black Sharpie, you will just have fun drawing vertical and horizontal lines. Notice how I'm always moving back and forth, trying to break up my paper into boxes that are all different. And there we go. The next step would then be coloring them in. You can use red crayons, colored pencils, and markers. You can use yellow colored pencils, crayons, and markers, and you can use blue markers, colored pencils, and crayons. And then of course you can use black. You would slowly color in each box using one of the primary colors or the black Sharpie. Be sure to leave some white behind. And of course, be sure to color in the boxes nice and neatly, staying in the lines and filling the shape in all the way so you don't see any white space. When you are finished with your picture, this is one of your wow pieces. So you will frame it, sign your name, and take a picture of it in Seesaw and then place it on the drying rack to dry.